All right, uh, where'd he go? And we're back in Ian Hulk land, right where we were before. This is another update video. Uh, it's not quite completed yet. I don't know if it really will ever be completed because it's just so much fun doing all this awesome stuff. There was so much stuff we did since the last update video that I don't even know how many episodes this is going to make. All right. So first of all, I turn around. Instantly, you see this. Oh, there's already a block on fire. This is the uh, crocodile's castle. It doesn't look like a crocodile, but it's just it's a quote. Um, it looks more like an elephant, I think. This is Ian's castle. I'm currently constructing my own castle at the other side of the area. Um, yeah. So those blocks around them will set on fire because there is l lava under these trapdoors. You guys probably know everything about drawbridges. To make them a little more leaf lethal, we used uh, lava. And I actually made the redstone go along. He was really confused with it, so I, I made it. Um, yeah, so we got a few things to show you guys. And down here, we have this little area right here. So there's also a secret entrance right up there. See, if you guys can see, there's the castle right there. And the person falls down. Probably got some bow and arrows, maybe uh, some guns, if once I install that gun mod. And you shoot the guys, and they come down. Over here, we got a tower. There's just bedrooms. It's mostly what it is. And, uh, go back up here. I'll show you guys this in a minute. This is like a secret getaway area. There's a ladder over there going up to the next floor. There's more bedrooms for the soldiers. A lot of cool stuff in here. Uh, alright. <coughs> up here. We got this bedroom over here. More bedrooms everywhere. More. And there is an there is an armory here. I'm not sure if it's loaded up yet. No, it's not loaded up yet. But this is supposed to be the armory. Armory. And, uh, yeah. This was, uh, f was going to be a secret room for the king. Because this is where the king will sit. We haven't fixed it yet. But it was going to be... We're going to use pistons. And have the blocks disappear by stepping on a pressure plate. But, uh, yeah, it didn't really work out too well, so, um, we decided not to do it. But I f think I found a way how to do it now, so, I will, I don't know if I'll help him anymore, because I'm building my own castle now. Yeah, so, up here we got, uh, there's, this is, like, pretty much the top of the castle. Snipe here. I'm not sure if these chests are loaded up either. But, yeah, they're supposed to have, like, food in there, so if you ever, like, are low on health, need some food. There's walls up here, so if you're injured, you can hide here so you can eat your food. This castle design is very, very bad in my my mind because uh, there's no purpose for you to hide. You have the gold right there, and you'll probably die if you're low on health. My castle's design is a lot better. I'll show you guys that later. All right, so that's pretty much all of uh, this. Oh, yeah. For the, the, the secret thing, the secret getaway. It's a pretty pretty basic room. Um, here's just a. Oh, I suck. Yeah, so this minecart goes down. Uh, wait here. This will be easier. Right. Two. Uh, let's see, ten. So we can get there really quickly. Yay! Probably get my mind hurt. Yay! Yes, yeah, so this is fast. Uh, where am I? All right, let's change the speed back. Back, back to one. All right. Did I come from this way? I was going so fast I couldn't even tell. I think I did. No, I know I didn't. Alright, so right here, um, this turns like a locked up room. There's only one way out. 
And that's if somebody's in here and they open up this. There's food in here. So pretty much, um, it's almost kind of like a bomb shelter. And then down here we have a similar room, except it's not as sealed away. Just more rooms there. And, uh, I don't remember. No, nothing's in there. Oh, it's raining outside. Alright, let's take this back. To, uh, this goes back to the castle, so. That's pretty much all that was in that secret, secret, uh, little hideaway area. Not that much. Just a little, little area. I really want to find out a way how to bring this onto an actual SMP server and invite a ton of my friends and subscribers and then we can have a battle between my castle and uh, Ian's castle. Let's just, uh, let's take a moment to turn this off. There we go. I'm not a fan of the rain. Oh, the sun's going down too. There we go. Day 141 here. We've had a lot of days. But I don't know if I've told you guys this yet, but this world actually started out as a single player world. Just everyday single player world, just like my my Hollywood. And uh yes, it turned into something uh more like this. We had another world called J Johnny Riddenland, which was uh bef I think it was before I started doing my videos. Oh yeah, I more stops. Uh so Johnny Riddenland was mm, it was not quite as good as this. It started as a single player world once again. But um it that was before the bo booster rails were came came in the I think a 1.5 update and we didn't have any of those. So we had to use the old boosters and once those stopped working yes, this is the beach house. We had to um make a new one, which was this world, which turned out a lot better. If anybody wants to see Johnny Riddenland, uh you can say so, but it doesn't work very well. So this is the beach house. Kind of just a little project that Ian did. Ian likes to do random things on here. I don't. I don't think I make as many things as Ian does, but I still make some stuff. All right, there's a diving board off here. We and uh, there's another floor. I didn't show you guys. Which has um another diving board off of it. Yeah, so, up here, this is top floor, this is for, for the, for the, for the daredevils, if you like going off high jumps. Woo! There we go. Alright, yeah, so let's punch the beach house. Just a little, little house. Up here, we have a lot of, a lot of interesting things. First, I'll show you my uh, zoo, which I'm going to install the Mo Creatures mod pretty soon. I still haven't gotten around to doing it. I installed the sing single player commands, which was really helpful for me just recently. And uh, yes, yeah, so eventually this will have more more animals in it. But right now, it's only got pigs and wolves because it's got a pig spawner, and it's got my wolves. Okay, here I'll just show you my wolves first. Those pigs spawn. Alright, yeah, so these are my wolves. There was a secret entrance up there, but then I blocked it all off, so they really couldn't really get in there very easily anymore. Plus, we had to switch back to 1.5 at a time because too many items was glitching up on us in 1.6. So that took out the trap door that was up there, where the hole is. And yeah, so those pigs should be spawning now. Yeah, we got some pigs in here. I decided to make it uh, two glass because it wasn't really working out for me very well because I would fall in trying to get up there. 
And over there, I don't really think there's much need to show you got that cabin over there. Because it really hasn't been done very well quite yet. It's still in progress. Right now, it's just a cabin in the middle of the lake. Eventually, it'll be something cool. Alright, over here, I had a lot of people watching this. We're wondering what this is. Yes, this is a lava pit. I'll read the story. Uh, one day, Ian McCulloch was really high. So he built a, a lava pit for no reason. Yes. I don't know if Ian's, Ian's getting high anymore. Probably not, but... Uh, I'm pretty sure he did at one point. Yeah, so... This is a lava pit. You can't fall in. For those of you who would like to fall in. You cannot. So yeah, that's French here. Uh, I'll just walk up here because there's the walls to show you guys. These walls, I think, were event meant to have a purpose. Ian built them. But uh, then they kind of just had no purpose after a while. I don't know if there will be a purpose to them. Purpose? This will be a purpose in Virgil. No, just it, it won't be a purpose in Virgil. Virgil will use this in Virgil. Virgil. Yeah. I think you guys are wondering about Virgil, actually. I uh, I don't know if I'm going to make any more episodes. I don't Because it's not complete, and there really isn't much point in making episodes on it. When it's not complete yet. Alright. Let's go. So, uh, wait, wait a minute. I just realized something. I passed something up there. At the, like near near the beginning, I don't know if you guys caught this. Uh, there's an, I built info stations in every section. This is section one. That bridge back there kind of marks the end of section one. Info stations are usually near the beginning of each section. I still haven't made an info station for section four, but I prob probably will. So yeah, yeah uh, I missed this. It's pretty noticeable too. I don't know how I missed it. I've been around here so many times, I don't really find the need to stop at everything. Alright, yeah, so I built all the info stations. This is info station one. Pretty much info stations tell you everything that's in the area. In this section. Okay, so things around Ian Colk's house, things around Crocodile's Castle, and things around Animal Zoo, Love Pit, and Bridge. So they haven't been updated too much, because I don't have the walls there. Last time I updated it was probably when I built them, which was a <laughs> long time, long time ago. Which right after I built, made the update video. My first update video. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to make this. Nope. Didn't think so. Alright. There we go. Okay, we're back on the move. That's easy. 